Yeah. You're able to do that pretty fast. E yeah. yeah it, it, it used to do e e yeah. And now I can hear it starting to separate. So that's good. And is, is there something that I, I could maybe like keep in mind as I'm doing that to like focus to make it more distinct? Two, two places that it's going to come from. E for everybody's going to be a little bit different. But for me, I can feel it. It's that it's that the muscle that you can make your um, this part of your throat kind of like flex where your Adam's apple is pretty much those muscles in there going it's the muscles that you would use to create the vibrato but then also it's the, the stomach bouncing along with it very um head voice like laugh <laughs> that you know that comes from here yeah. but then yep. instead of it having the <laughs> instead of it doing that <laughs> like like imagine if you were like trying to you're wearing a you know a sheet and you're like yeah. that's what it is yeah. <laughs> it's this okay. go see and, and then it's just moving it up and down <laughs> i'm so glad we're recording this <laughs> i might i might end up using this as like a little like side video of you like hey this is how you yeah. find this <laughs> Behind. So many times where I'm like, shucks, we should be recording this because I come up with ways that I'm like, that makes sense. I feel like people would see that and hear that, you know. And it's it sucks because you're in the moment and you're feeling it, and then the, these ideas come to you, and then they're like gone. So if you don't record it, you know, you're out of the moment. You're like, like what was it? It was so simple. It came to me so easy. And now it's gone. And now thinking, I want to hear you try that. Go. E e e e e e that's how you get vibrato too okay lean on me that's where you can get that like duh, that soulful like vibrato without it being me without it being operatic yeah so with the vibrato you're are you controlling it more with your stomach kind of coming in and out it's a bunch of different stuff if it's Brandy Carlisle, her vibrato is huge. Bring green out, of course you are. She's, you know, ah. So that's me doing everything that I just said to you. Ah, yeah, okay. That's the, that's the man-made vibrato. Let it go. I'll, that's me adding that. That is not my natural vibrato. Go. That's my stomach going, and this going, yeah, go. That's that's more my natural, but I can still feel this going, bo. Yeah. So your your voice just naturally does that when you're like sustaining a note. Okay. Because that's something that I've never had. So I've always like forced it. And like, at, like we've talked about too, I'm kind of undoing what I had taught myself because it's in, incorrect. But I just thought that you're supposed to, it's supposed to be natural. Like it's not supposed to be man-made, so to speak. Or like you're not supposed to force yourself to bit of all of that okay yes we want it to be natural 100 in the classical world you want it to be natural because that's uh how you don't hurt your voice but in different genres or when you want a specific kind of flavor to that vibrato it's okay to make it man-made we we do want to find your natural vibrato because that's where the spinning or the openness or the it doesn't get stuck um yeah I, I keep coming back to lean on me, but like if I were to sing sing it with no vibrato, lean on me when you're not strong. And you notice how it feels like it's not flat, but it's kind of on the flatter side, right? Yeah. It's not blossoming. Lean on yeah. me. I could keep yep. it there. Me. And then it just feels like it's not going anywhere and it just stuck. Or me when you're, right, right? It can kind of like just, Open, open it, it up. and that is a natural vibrato me that's my natural vibrato coming in wow. and that's me just relaxing the chords on the note so i'm not trying to put pressure on them to stay i don't know straight or whatever like no vibrato yeah, not flat but just yeah straight yeah. yeah okay now that we've talked about this this uh ooh, that thing <laughs> try this yeah. for me. just go you know find find the note that works well for you on lean on me and i want you to just try lean on me see if you can let it go lean on me 
lean on me. Good. Yes, and I can. Can you hear it on me? It's already like that's your. That's definitely a natural vibrato. You never had that when we first started Les Hands. Like Les, it just sounded like Miranda sings when we first started Les Hands. <laughs> <laughs> What the heck was that? Anyway, <laughs> that was funny. Um, but now you have it. Now we got to figure out how to get that same openness on lean. Because what I'm hearing now is lean, lean on me is what I'm hearing where it's like opening up on me. And you ever yeah. brought sound over, over the top like mine does on it. I have to control mine. So it doesn't yeah. sound like it's me <laughs> because that's just sure. my natural vibrato. But we need to figure out how to have yours also go lean on me so that they all yeah. have it. And it's not lean on me. So take your time on each of those notes. Lean on me. Lean, lean, lean on, lean on me. Yeah. Lean. I'm trying to relax. Mm -hmm. on me. Oh, but see, even that last one though, because you were trying and you were like, you, you kind of like made your subconscious go to what you were touching to relax. Yeah. It. I heard it went, when you weren't touching it, I heard, I heard lean, lean. And then this one I heard lean. Just a, see how, so subtle, but you so, hear how it's a little more open, a little bit more. Yeah rounded yeah lean on me you're never gonna sound like an opera singer because you didn't study opera i don't want to be an opera singer i don't want to be a broadway singer you're never gonna sound like that because you never right. studied it you to think that just adding some ver vibrato is gonna make you sound like an opera singer or a broadway singer to all of your audience is completely not true it's like i don't want to go to the gym because i don't want to look like a bodybuilder right Right. Yeah. But, I love that analogy. You start yeah. off at five and then you get to 50 and then all of a sudden you get to five. You're like, this is way too easy. The same thing happens with your breath control. I, I know what like the start of like a phrase, I feel like a lot more tighter. I don't know if I'm pushing too much air or something, but I do feel like they can kind of start out tight and then it'll open up as like the phrase goes on. So try this for me. Try the lean, but I want you to just keep going for it until you feel like it opens. Lee, 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 until you find the space. You might have to move some of this around, you know, to sure. here. It might have to lift, feel like it's lifting. You might have to let your shoulders relax, a bigger breath, whatever it is. When you do, hold it out and then try to get to on. Okay. Lean, 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 lean on me. Lean, man, lean on me. Here's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing lee. So I'm I'm hearing that the tongue is very close to the roof of your mouth. Lee. Yeah. It's a very small space for the E to come through. Try singing from more of an li an I space but making it sound like an E. Lee. 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 Almost like an A or I sound. Lee. Like a Lee. Lee. Yeah, I mean, that feels more open. What, what's happening is the back of the tongue is relaxing. Lee. It's just, it's such a subtle placement of like just this front part of your tongue. Lee. See if you can find that without it closing too far. That might not sound like an E because you're so used to it being Lee, but it sounds Party. like an E out here. And that's where we want that to come from. Lee, mm. Lee. It's almost like I'm saying Lee. Lee. You, it'll sound like E when I get to the end of lean. 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 Yeah. Focus on that open sound, opener, openest sound. More open. Yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> Try it again. Lean yeah. on me. Lean on me. Yeah, listen how warm that is. Yeah, that sounded way more open. So I'm not fully getting like the vibrato on the front. What you have there is you have a spin on that word. Lean sure. on me. Open it up so it's not lean. So if I were to sing that and then open it. Lee. So there's no vibrato on there, but you see how much warmer it is? Yeah. 
it sounds way more in tune even though the first one was it's just like more body it has or even with, with the vibrato with the movement you're kind of in between those two which makes it feel fuller is making it sound more in tune vibrato is like a fingerprint everyone is different they're natural vibrato now and there are some people who can mimic other people's vibrato very easily but the natural vibrato is your voice's fingerprint your vibrato when you hold out certain notes might be faster and that's okay first part of lean the fact that you can feel that it's more open that's it's spinning sure it's still giving it the movement yes. and like, like texture that you want on it lean on me so it has more of like the mm. swag to it yes. yeah i think i was like quick to be critical you focus on the that you don't have so never really having a vibrato, I hear all these other singers with it. I'm trying to go for vibrato and it's not there. Oh, that's not right then. But even like working with you and feeling that too, the tone just felt way more open, way just like richer, I guess would be the word that I, I would use. So focusing less on like what I hear other people do, if I can practice what we just did and just getting it open, it'll yeah. sound good. Yeah. I'm, I'm happy. Let's try this. Lean on me when you're not strong. See if you can get it to there. Lean on me when you're not strong. Good. The lean still wants to do lean. lean. So far down here, lean. Yeah. And we needed to go lean, lean versus lean. lean. Lean, yeah. lean on me. Okay. Still wants to kind of scoop. So let's try la 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 la. But go la la la. And then lean on me. Lean, 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 lean on me. First L, you want to go lean, 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 Lay. Now I'm thinking more just like lay, like lay. If I just lay, lay, then it's like I don't do the scoop as much with okay. lee. Yeah. Lay, not like just I don't know, and then it stays open. If lay open. works better, then the a vowel is it for lean. Lay on me when you're not strong. All right. Lean on me yeah. when you're not strong. Good. Yeah, yeah. I, I heard it a little bit on the when. When you're, when, when, when you're not. Instead of when, it's just when, when, with an H almost. When, when, you're, when, you're, when you're not you strong. Go. Yeah, that one didn't have it. I think that yeah. would be another next level for you because um, now that I'm thinking about it, a lot of times when you start certain phrases, it wants to do that. It wants to start lower and then go up. So when, I don't want you to overthink when you're performing, but maybe like on certain songs, if you hear it, just make a mental note to that that's something we can work toward finding out why. It's funny, I, like I had the guys over for practice yesterday and that there's no drums, so it was nice. I was able to just kind of focus on my singing and playing. But I noticed that I was like doing that with certain notes. I was kind of like scooping it, I guess is what I'll call it. Is that like common with other people? Very yeah. common with people, with, with any singers who haven't found the ability to release like we were working on today, releasing the spin, vibrato, the sparkle, whatever you want to call it. And it's not... When I say vibrato, I'm not talking about releasing it where it's like, bah, but bah, it's so subtle, but it's just yeah. open. Where it's not, bah, yeah. which is going to go, bah, to get there. But we want, bah, yeah. You're not the only okay. one. Gotcha. All right. Well, maybe that's something I can work on too, is just kind of coming up with um, like a practice or a warm up where I'm just kind of trying to hit the notes without like scooping to them. I love ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, versus I. Start it with the air. I, I love. I love to sing. Now listen how yeah. wonderful the rest of that was because of that. Yeah. When you've done it before, it usually goes, I love, and it's a little bit under it. That one was per. I love to. Everything was perfectly in tune. All right. I'll focus on that. Every time we start doing warm ups, we always seem to get to a place where we're like, okay, let's work on this little thing. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. 
Yeah, and that helps in even if like I'm not singing all the time, like when I'm asking you questions, it's helping me understand things too, which like Good. helps me like internalize it and sing it, you know, or just like where are the, where is this coming from? Like what should I be using here? So it's it's all relative. I, I appreciate this as much as you know, just going through stuff too. Great. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Have a great <laughs> afternoon. Yes, you as well. Bye-bye. Bye.